right, now it's time for WTF. What the Fela? Joining me now, Jimmy Fela, host of Fox Across America. Jimmy! All right, the former hey, hey, hey. Australian Prime Minister, a woman, had some trouble answering a little question. Watch. What is a woman? Oh, I'm very happy to answer your question. In the UK, this has turned into a kind of got you parlour game. And I think we've just got to move away from all of that. Jimmy, um, <laughs> would, you have, <laughs> would you have a problem answering that question tonight? No, not according to the videos in my search history. Good goodness. Uh, but stick with me, Laura. Uh, she needs to be careful, because if she keeps failing to define what a woman is, the Democrats will put her on the Supreme Court. <laughs> this is the dumbest time there's ever been to be alive, because people who legitimately consider themselves feminists have declared war on themselves. Here it is really quickly. We could go through the clinical definition of an adult human female, but what everybody at home needs to know is there's women and people who dress like women. But dressing like one doesn't make you one, okay? I was Superman for Halloween three times. My mom never threw me off the house Aww. because she knew I couldn't fly. Why? Because I wasn't Superman. Yeah, I don't doubt she wanted to, but the point is it didn't make me Superman just to put on the costume, Laura. Jimmy, we've also heard a lot about the Biden brand lately. They're really selling this Biden oh. brand. But I'm not sure, just like with a woman question, some people just don't know what the Biden brand is. So our own Peter Ducey, he tried to get some answers. Watch this. Devin Archer talks about how he and Hunter Biden tried to profit off the Biden brand. What is the Biden brand? I'm not going to get into it from here. I'm not going to get into it from here. We're going to move on. Jimmy, she needed to buy a vowel on that. She, even she doesn't know what the Biden brand is, other than maybe decline and despair. <laughs> well, listen, they're getting $500,000 for a painting. And uh, if you think the price is high, you should meet the painter. Oh, my goodness. I guess over the course of the last month, if I had to answer this question, I would think the Biden brand was a travel agency that books beach getaways. Because every time mm. I see them, Joe's on the beach shirtless, eating an ice cream cone. Ooh. Hunter's naked somewhere on the Internet. They're kind of like an all-inclusive, I think is what you'd call it. But I don't know that that's what the oligarchs and the Ukrainian power companies were paying for. The Biden brand, as you know, is an influence peddling scheme. And uh, I'm glad the jig is almost up. Right down to the fake names they use in their email accounts. All right, Jimmy. I um, mean, come on. That, that's, the cl that's a classic, isn't it? Um, th by the way, the Biden administration also, I think they may have realized that they haven't sucked all the happiness from Americans because they announced that they might go down <laughs> to a guideline of two beers per week to stay healthy. Mm -hmm. So the <laughs> ceiling fans, lawns, cars, gas stoves, but touch America's beer, what happens then? Thank you. And it's easy for this White House to ban beer because they've got cocaine. OK, the rest of us don't have bags of cocaine lying around like the White House does. So shame on them to come after our beer. Are you kidding me? But I got to be honest with you. I don't for a second think Joe Biden. Could you imagine drinking at the White House? You got to give 10 percent of your beer to the big guy. And how would we even know if he was drunk? Like he's already shaking hands with invisible people and sniffing babies, okay? I sincerely doubt he's drinking. So this is another example of Democrats passing guidance that doesn't <laughs> affect them. It's a scam, Ingram. It's a scam. Well, J Jimmy, you know, I don't think nitroglycerin, do they still give that for heart conditions and beer? I don't think you can take both at the same time. There's some kind of weird reaction. So he's not a beer guy. I think we can, we can get that. So warm no. milk at night with a half a banana. All right, Jimmy, great to see you as always. <laughs>